Since the dawn of mankind, humans have looked for solutions to problems in their everyday lives. One such problem that is often overlooked is the design of a knife. We've all used knives before. They can be used to cut, crush, but they can also make our lives hell. Food sticks to the knife, and when you try to wipe it off, you're bound to get nicked. The pain is more than just physical. It cuts deep. The design of a knife has remained relatively unchanged for years. Many doubted that it could ever change. A better knife, I mean, I, I didn't think it was physically possible. Until one team, one brave team, made it their mission to slice through the competition. I'm glad you asked. They call it the ESA knife, featuring these non-patented components. It all starts with the top foundation. Two L brackets screwed in on either side of the blade provides improved ergonomic handling, garlic crushing, and just a foundation for the rest of the attachment. Another crucial component of the knife is the bushing standoff combination. This is placed inside the bushing and then press fit into the knife which allows the lever to rotate about a fixed axis on the knife. The trigger, conveniently located at the fingertips of the user, is a rigid body that connects to the wiper blade. The spring is absolutely essential to our mechanism as it brings the wiper blade back up to its resting position. The wiper blade is a component that cleans the knife. Made out of PVC, it has a low coefficient of friction against the blade, allowing for non-resistive cleaning of the knife itself. After extensive CAD modeling and fabrication work, a final product was made and tested on an unsuspecting consumer. Yeah. Yeah. Cut it. 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 Them bricks is way too high, you need to cut it. Although this design met the desired needs, there were still improvements to be made. One issue was that the two parts making up the lever were connected by a screw that gradually loosened over time. A way to improve this would be to either weld the two parts together or to machine a single part that had the angle required. Another issue was that the knife itself was relatively small and there was very limited area with which to cut. An improvement to this would be to use a larger knife in this design so that larger fruits and vegetables could be cut. With these improvements, the processes of cutting and cooking could be changed forever. On behalf of Maskoff Design, we'd like to thank you for watching this video and learning about our product. And we'd like to take this opportunity to introduce you to our team.